Hello, this is Eric Mills, Editor-in-Chief of Naval History Magazine, presenting the Combat Fleet's column from the January 2023 Proceedings, Russia's Steregushki-class frigates by Eric Wertheim. The Steregushki-class, Project 20380, family of frigates, has served with Russia's Baltic Sea and Pacific fleets for more than a decade. But new variants are coming online as the class is adapted for the future. The Almaz Central Naval Design Bureau in St. Petersburg designed these frigates to replace aging Grisha-class corvettes on coastal and offshore operations. The initial prototype, the Steregushki, was laid down in December 2001 at Severnaya Verf in St. Petersburg and commissioned 27 February 2008. She operates with a crew of around 100, displaces 2,220 tons fully loaded, and measures 343 feet long with a 43-foot beam and 12-foot draft. The design incorporates stealthy characteristics and includes a steel hull, a hangar and landing deck for one KA-27 anti-submarine warfare helicopter, and a composite superstructure. Project 20380 frigates are powered by CODAD, Combined diesel and diesel propulsion with four diesel engines and two propellers, providing a top speed of 27 knots and range of around 4,000 nautical miles at 14 knots. The warships are fitted with a 100mm gun forward and two quadruple launchers amidships for KH-35 3M24 Euron switchblade anti-ship missiles, which have a range of 70 to 140 nautical miles, depending on the variant. Namesake Teragushki carries a Kortik Kashtan CADS N1 point defense system, combining short range SA N11 surface to air missiles, aka SAMs, and 30mm guns for self defense. The second frigate, Subratsa Telony, commissioned in 2011. The, the Subratsa Telony and subsequent sisters carry a 12 cell Reddit air defense vertical launch system, VLS, instead of the CADS N1 for point defense and are sometimes dubbed the Steregushki II class, or Project 20381. Production of this second batch of frigates has taken place at the original shipyard, as well as at Amor shipyard in Kozomolsk in eastern Russia. By late 2022, at least seven Steregushki I and II class frigates were in service with the Pacific and Baltic fleets. More than a dozen are planned. An export variant, the Project 20382, Tiger frigate, has been offered to several foreign navies. A further advancement of the design, the Gromashki class, Project 20385, was introduced in 2019 and is sometimes called the Steregushki III class. At 348 feet, this class is slightly longer, with an integrated mast and other stealthy enhancements. Previous missile systems have been replaced with an expanded 16-cell Reddit SAM system and an 8-cell VLS capable of firing long-range caliber 3M14 land attack missiles and 3M55 Onyx anti-ship missiles. In the future, the hypersonic Zircon missile is expected to be carried as well. At least three additional Gromashki class frigates are being built. A heavily modified and even larger gas turbine variant of the class, Project 20386, has been under construction since 2016 and is expected to enter service as early as 2023. Additional units and design variants of the Steregushki will likely follow. 